Good morning. Welcome again to Morning Devotions. Thank you again for our time together. Well, we're in the book of Revelation, almost finishing going through the whole Bible again this year. Revelation chapter 2, beginning with verse 1. Write this letter to the angel of the church of Ephesus. This is the message of the one who holds the seven stars in his right hand and the one who walks among the seven golden lampstands. He said, listen, I, I control the message of the churches and I walk among the churches. He said, I know all the things you do. Now listen to his compliments. I have seen your hard work, your patient endurance. I know that you do not tolerate evil people. You've examined the claims of those who say they're apostles but are not and discovered that they are liars. You've patiently suffered for me without quitting. But I have one complaint against you. You've lost your first love. Now, we always preach about the loss of the first love. And that's a problem. The love of many grow cold in the last days because of the preponderance of sin. Paul challenged the church of Ephesus, have a love for God that never fades. Yes, all of that is a problem. But I want you to notice the things he complimented them on. He said, I've seen your hard work. Christian, can Jesus compliment you on your hard work for the kingdom today? Your patient endurance. Christian, can you stand in the face of pressure and temptation and patiently endure? They did. I know that you don't tolerate evil people. He said, all right. You don't sit there and accept everybody who walks into the church and sleeps around with everybody. You don't, you don't tolerate the drunkenness and sexual immorality and drugs and everything else. He said, you don't tolerate that. that that's a good thing. See, as Christians, forgive me, we're too tolerant. These people were complimented by Jesus for not being tolerant. He said, you've examined the claims of those who say they're apostles but are not. He said, you know what? A lot of people are running around claiming to be preachers, claiming to have a call of God on their life, and they don't. And Jesus said, I compliment you on recognizing that a lot of these people are self-called or devil-called. He said, I compliment you on that. He said, you've discovered that they're liars. He said, you, you know how to dig through this. He said, you've patiently suffered for me without quitting we live in a world today where nobody wants to suffer. We want everything to be easy, but these people suffered for Jesus and never quit. Now, we, we always talk about the first love part, but could I ask that you sit down and in your own heart, look at yourself today and ask yourself, okay, I may have the first love part down, but can Jesus compliment me on these other things? <laughs> <laughs>